what did we say before? No closeness, Mr. Angelini. No. Are you coming to dinner? Yes. I thought so fast. I would have answered really fast. Don't apologize. This, 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 everything is getting me. Hey guys, it's Gabby. I'm back for the Mafia Nanny. Um, last time we left off, it was a whole practice arena. Um, turns out the kid was not crying for help. Um, because he was in on it. You know, Adam was in on it too. I was like, I was like even saying like, I like you, Adam. I like too. But it turns out he was just part of the test. She passed and now we're in the house. Now the question is, what does Mr. Angelini know about her? And what happened to Mama Dearest? In one year, when it's time to leave Leon, I'll sign any recommendation you write. Oh. Oh, we were making a deal. I forgot. Yeah. If, however, any harm would to befall my son. Yeah, yeah, we get it. We get it. <sighs> what did we say before? No closeness, Mr. Angelini. No. You sure about that? You sure about that? You sure about that? You'll wish you'd die protecting him. Okay. He meant it. His eyes said it all. I mean, his closeness said it all. <laughs> that man will kill me slowly. I'm laughing because literally that's what he's doing. Good thing an elite nanny never fails. I can take those. You've done enough heavy lifting today. What's that supposed to mean? Yeah, well, what would that mean? Heard you're staying. Nice work. I'll go take these upstairs. Have a look around the house. It's home for the next year. Mm-hmm. Oh, the whole year. <laughs> Unless something goes horribly wrong. Why would you say that, Adam? <laughs> I can't tell if he's rooting for me or against me. Both. It's always both. It's never one or the other. Hmm. Oh my god, who are you? <laughs> what? He never mentioned a bodyguard before. <laughs> no hard feelings, right? Oh, he's the guy from the last episode. <laughs> Got it. This one must be mine. I should charge my laptop. Oh yeah, hacking skills. Huh? That's right, I left it in the car. Well, we could just go get it, <laughs> right? It's gone. Adam is having it detailed. Are you coming to dinner? Yes. That was so fast, I would have answered really fast. <laughs> dinner? Senora Conte cooks before she leaves on weeknights. My laptop. I'll remind Adam when he gets back with the car. Yeah, we need it. <laughs> Shall I bring Mikey down? Don't bother. He's elected to eat in his room tonight. Okay, like, again, I would eat in my room, but... Does anybody just not eat in the dining tables? <laughs> Does that happen often? Lately, yes. He's had a lot of changes recently. A big move and a new caretaker on top of the loss of his... Uh, I don't need your one-day diagnosis. I didn't mean... I know my son. Don't explain his feelings to me. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. Worry about his safety. Nothing more. Understood? Oh, he's just listening. Oh, he's not even pretending <laughs> that he's not at the door. I am hungry, but this is a bit... That's... I would ask for seconds. Oh, awkward. Uh, exactly what I said. <laughs> Anna never covered making small talk with my employer. So, uh, what brings you to Leon? 
Business. Okay, why do you have to say it so mad? <laughs> Business? What's a Venetian underboss doing in Leon anyway? They don't have a claim here, and the local crime families can't be happy. I imagine a man of your position has made some waves in the city. You could say that. No remorse. Doesn't he know he's putting Mikey at risk? I'm pretty sure he knows. Speaking of Mikey, do you have any goals for Mikey this year? Goals? Anything you want me to work on with him? Language, arts, sports? Uh, he's hesitating. We could help. We can help. I'll think about it. As the Angelini heir, Mikey has certain expectations to live up. Okay. That was odd. But then, this whole house is odd. Staff are like ghosts. I've seen them around the house, but I've only met the driver. I mean, but what about the car? No? What? And why am I the only one eating with the boss? We're special. Maybe because it's my first night, an empty gesture of welcome, I'll play along. Is that sparkling water? I don't like sparkling water. <laughs> don't. I mean, you guys could drink sparkling water. Personally. I've tried it. It's disgusting. <laughs> what does Mikey normally do during the day? Normally, I take him to work with me. Well, that's great. That ends now. Ooh. Julia, we oui? give us a moment, please. Oh my God, what is he gonna do? <laughs> I'm scared. We, oui, Monsieur. Now I've done it. Mm-hmm. Oh God, why is he up? Come with me. Mr. Angelini, I, not another word. And Tony, boss. <laughs> He's still mad. <laughs> I apologize for speaking out of turn. Don't. I, what? Don't apologize. <sighs> this, this, this everything. It's getting me. Stop. On that point, we agree. I don't understand. Look scared. What is he? Be afraid, Davina. Oh, was I supposed to yell that? <gasps> Good. Now listen. You asked whether I have goals for Mikey. I have one. Two. Boss. Crunch, crunch. Matter the. What is it? Trouble in District 3. What is this, the Hunger Games? <laughs> we'll continue this later. Yes, sir. What was he going to say? What is his goal? Well, we're just gonna have to figure it out. Mm. And why is he afraid of anyone else hearing it? Uh, well, isn't that because he doesn't trust anybody of his workers? Like, even Adam? <laughs> the next morning, I guess you thought I wouldn't notice that I wouldn't care. You've been stealing from the Angelinis, haven't you? Although, <laughs> I actually thought this was a sting. <laughs> what? The? Haven't you? Mikey? I'm busy. I, I see that. Breakfast is ready. I'll take it in my room. Boy, you gotta eat downstairs, please. You had dinner here last night. Are you afraid to eat human food in front of me? Human food? <laughs> it's okay. You can tell me. I've already guessed you're a... Vampire. What? <laughs> it makes sense. You avoid going outside, eat where no one can see your fangs. I'm not a vampire! That's exactly what a vampire would say. I just don't want to eat with you. Is that all? Not to worry then, I already ate. But the kitchen is all yours. That's not. See you downstairs, boss. Oh, God. 
See, that, that part, that last part, it was a little grungy. <laughs> First breakfast down. Good job, me. And what the heck? Cheeky kid. At least he ate it. Ahem. <clears throat> you must be Signora Conte. I'm Davina. English, adio. Adieu. <laughs> Why are you in my kitchen? I'll be taking over breakfast and lunch for Mikey from now on. I'll try not to be in your way. At least you clean. Excuse me. <laughs> Signor Angelini needs his coffee. Any problems with your room? Did you sleep? This room is lovely, but I didn't sleep a wink. I couldn't shake the feeling that someone was watching me. <laughs> someone just- Hi, how are you? Signora, my coffee. Right away. It's him. Is he going to pretend last night didn't happen? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Problem. Guess that answers my question. No, sir. I should check on Mikey. I don't understand him at all. No one does. What was he going to tell me about Mikey? And you better pay up. Got it? No one crosses the Angelinis. One well, guess where he learned that. Because <laughs> he brings him to work. As long as he's occupied, I wonder if my laptop... Aha! It's about time. I've been dying to do some proper research. Oh, research about Angelini? <laughs> Hello. His bio barely said anything. Angelini plus crime plus Venus. Venice. Oh, the Angelinis. They've been running the Venetian mafia for nearly a century. The current Don is Gabriel's uncle. His older brother died and he took the reins. The Don has no sons though, which explains why his nephew is the underboss. And that leaves Mikey heir to it all. Yeah, but what happened to the wife? No wonder he's such a serious kid. Let's see what the darker chat rooms have to say. What are the angels playing at? Go back to Italy, no one wants you here. Okay. As I thought. He's making enemies, and they've only been here a month. What could be worth wadding into so much trouble? Did they run out of crimes to commit in Italy? Girl, did you make sure your door was closed? Because I, I was actually a little worried <laughs> that Mr. Angela, you was behind door. <laughs> Crazy lady, I need you. Coming, boss. I was like, who's talking? <laughs> What's going on? Papa and I are going on an overnight. I can't find my favorite tie. He thinks he's going? I think we should stay here while your father goes on his trip. He needs my help. Oh, there goes the chocolate milk. I gotta take that away from you. <laughs> He's meeting the Croatian syndicate. They control lots of the major smuggling routes in France, and they hate the Angelinis. Is that true? Yeah, I think so. And how on earth would he know? I have to go with him. People underestimate Papa when he's with me. It's part of our edge. Yeah, but they're gonna come after you. Okay, sweetie? <laughs> it's disturbing that he stopped this through. Back me up, okay? I... Oh, it's... Oh, okay. Mikey, be good for Davina. I'll be back tomorrow night. I'm coming with you. I'm almost packed. You're staying here where it's safe. But the Croatians are none of your concern. Yeah. Uncle would want... No. I can help, Papa. You'll help me by staying behind. <laughs> Keep him safe. Uh, yeah, hopefully there's no practice tests anymore. Wait. Mr. Angelini. Yes. I like access to your security systems. We'll discuss it when I get back. What the heck? Okay. Well, this would, we would have fun with him. I guess. Looks like it's just us for dinner. Get out. Why don't we talk about get out? Oh, poor baby. I'm sorry. I didn't back you up. But your father made his wishes clear to us both. 
We'll have lots of fun until he comes back. You'll see. There's nothing fun about being left behind. Aww. I feel bad. <laughs> Where was that? Um. We have some feelings, so it's not too much. I do feel bad for poor Mikey. You know, he just wanted to go with his dad, support him. But, in all honesty, if I was her, right, I wouldn't say anything. Point is to, to keep him safe, his kid, because his wife was murdered. Mind you, he, he told us in the last episodes. But, yeah, we still don't know nothing about that, and I think we're gonna go back to the past a little bit. But, yeah, you know, this, this was, a uh, this was okay. A soft, slow burn to everything, you know? Don't trust the employees, maybe. Uh, maybe I trust Adam a little bit, because I think he's a cool guy. But everybody else? I don't know, there could be a mole, who knows? It's the mafia. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that. And if you did, leave a like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>